Welcome to the 2021 Memorial Day event for the Iowa Gold Star Military Museum. My name is Sherry Colbert, and on behalf of the staff, the board, and the volunteers here at the museum, we apologize that we can't give you this event live and in person this year due to the pandemic. But what we'd like to do is give you a virtual event so that you feel like you're here and that you're experiencing everything that you would if you were here in person with all of us. We're just going to walk you through some of the highlights of what we would do on Memorial Day here at the museum. One of the features of our virtual event this year is Des Moines North High School's Junior ROTC. What a great group of young people that have great leaders that are showing them everything about the military and about the Marines. And guess what? At least 10 of them are joining the military when they graduate. Isn't that exciting? One of the other exciting things we have this year, we have a gold star mother who tells a story of how she lost her child. And just to give the meaning of Memorial Day and the sacrifice, not only that her child has made, but the family and their loss. We also have footage from a couple people you may recognize. One is Dr. Vincent Lewis, who is an educator here in the Des Moines area. He's a Vietnam veteran. In addition, we have retired Colonel Todd Jacobus, who is um, a Hoover High School graduate here in Des Moines, and he talks about loss of troops when he was a commander. We also have footage from our own Bob Holliday, who's the board chair here at the Iowa Gold Star Military Museum. Bob serves this board in honor of his father, who was lost in World War II. And finally, no Memorial Day would be complete without the laying of the wreath by the Knights of Columbus. In addition, we play taps and how we always end our Memorial Day event here at the museum. We hope that you will subscribe to our YouTube page, like us on Facebook, and visit our website for all the great things that we want to show you today to honor our veterans. Looking ahead to 2022, we're going to give you some of the same great features that we have in the past. No, we don't have Van and Bonnie, which we thank them for their many years of service and broadcasting live. But for 2022, we're looking forward to Maxwell and Amy, who will be broadcasting live from the museum here. And in addition, we will have our traditional military style breakfast. So come out and see us again in 2022. We plan our old traditions and we're gonna throw in some new twists so that we can keep it interesting for you and that we never forget to honor those who gave the ultimate sacrifice. See you in 2022.